Anthony Taylor is your big match referee, but it's the first time he's refereeing Bournemouth this season, the second time uh, for the Blades. He did the one-all draw at Aston Villa, so maybe that hopefully uh, bodes well because Sheffield United got a good game plan that night and came within uh, minutes of a, a famous victory. Here comes Solanke through wrestling with the shirts, both Solanke and, uh, and Trusty there. It's going to come out just outside the box for a shot straight at uh, Gerbic. Yeah, he's on the ball now and he's going to play it through to Brereton. Diaz is going to shoot low. Couldn't hit the corners. The ball goes through the to the centre for Solanke. Mason Hoggett's in the third of his three-match ban today. Here's uh, Christie, 30 yards from goal. Ball in from the left-hand side. It's up in the air from Robinson. Gerbic has to watch this. And then with Solanke jumping at the keeper, Bournemouth have gone down forward. Palmer is uh, hobbling a little bit, but we'll stick with this as Clivert plays it in the area. Tavernier coming off the left-hand side. Big swing and a miss from him. That's and then a poor out. challenge on the far side by uh, Kirkes. Here's Robinson, arrows it into the box, looking for McBurney, cleared towards Bogle. Bogle over the top, but just a looping header. Justin Cliver. And the Dutch international will be fouled by Ben Osborne. Tavernier yeah. is going to play it low along the ground, looking oh, for Solanke, diving in is Tom Davis. Penalty to Bournemouth. Caught them out a little bit. Definite penalty. Davis went sliding in. Took down Solanke. Five or six, little stutter step. He'll hit it and he slips. He slips and he hits the penalty over the top of the bar. And that is a moment he will want to forget as Sheffield United are going to look to come forward here with Harmer. Ben Brereton, Diaz, challenge comes across. Oh, and, him. Well, it's going to be a yellow card as well. Couple weights on the edge of the box. Harmer's going to put it in towards the back stick, but Neto's going to claim it. Almost looking to work it with uh, Tavernier. Going across there is George Ball, that gets the block in. Corner to Bournemouth, an in-swinging ball, it's low. It's going to come into Semenyo over the top. And I tell you what, the set pieces so far mm. from Bournemouth have been inventive. Corner of the box for Tavernier, oh. then into the box for Semenyo, who drills it across from an acute angle. Smith, this time the corner in deep. Sheffield United's best defender in Oli McBurney, getting the header away. Here's... Uh, Tavernier down the right hand side for Christie. Whips one in looking for Solanke. It's come off the back of his head. Gerbich is going to watch it carefully. Lost two games in a row coming into this one as the long throws out in towards McBurney. Appeal for hands in the box. Little half hearted. Solanke towards the edge of the area for Tavernier. Low into the box. Ooh. Solanke's there. He's coming back again here from Bournemouth on the left from uh, Tavernier. Overlapping run from Christie into the area, looking for Solanke, clear to the edge of the box. Semenya has got far too what much space. Gerbic with an excellent save, away to his right-hand side. Bogle will clear. Harmer to McBurney, McBurney's going to play it through. Harmer's there, keeps it going. Bogle on the right-hand side, Ooh. shoots, saved. Yes! Harmer will drill in. Hits the top corner. Sheffield United react quickest. And just as he did at Nottingham Forest and Spurs early in the season, it's Gus Harmer on the road, on the score sheet, and Sheffield United are ahead here after 27 minutes. A nice move, well done by Bogle, from brilliant following up by Gus Harmer, fourth of the season. What a scoreline this would be. Bournemouth nil, Sheffield United won. Bournemouth looking to try and cut through here is Christie on the far side. Side netting. <laughs> Gus Harmer. Digs out the ball into the area, looking for McBurney with the header towards goal, eight yards out. Kirkes back to uh, Christie into the middle, header goalwards and another wonderful save from Gerbic away to his right. Then Kirkes into the box, it's deflected, Solanke down and then Christie towards Davis, little flick on towards the back post and Neto's going to just palm it away for a blades corner. A minute and a half of stoppage time, aiming towards Trusty, edge of the box now for Harmer who hits it. Harmer will uh, put it towards Ooh. the white post. McBurney with the header down. Arrows won with some force towards McBurney, who heads into the middle. Solanke's there to clear away. Bogle back over the top. Tavernier down the left-hand side. Clivert's in there. It's going to be pulled back to Kirkes. Save once again by Gerbic. Lovely little chest by Robinson. Back to him as well as Anthony Taylor will blow the whistle of half-time. The change at the break is Vinny Souza is on for Tom Davis, which is a real surprise given how influential Davis was on the first half. Yeah. Robinson arrows the long throw into the area looking for McBurney. It's going to come to the edge of the air. It's going to be drilled by Harmer. Ooh. Deflected into the middle. Souza's going to set it up. Ben Brereton. Diaz trying to pull the trick. Here's Tavernier, wonderful first touch as the crossfield ball finds him on the left-hand side. Into the area, 
cuts inside, goes back out to the left. Christie drives it from 20 over the top of the bar. Chip over the top, Watara through the bike, that's good oh. work by Harmer, Bogle's in, going down is Christie in the area, and George Baldock is not happy with him at all, and he's telling him exactly that. Here's Harmer into the middle, McBurney just outside the box, he's going to curl it goalwards, probably had a little bit more time as well. Pull it back to the edge of the area for Christie, looks for the give and go, Solanke trying to turn, now Semenyo, three yellow shirts get across oh. there and block. Low corner into the area, but Gus Harmer's watched it. Does he then bring down Clivert? Home fans wanted it. I mean, the uh, officials weren't there. Nobody else really appealed either. Good win oh, by well McBurney. Brilliant touch by Arblaster. Arblaster will go into the area. Can he get his shot away? Oh. Gun! Excellent save by Neto down to his right. Oh, I thought that well. was going to be a golden moment. Here's... Uh, the corner from the left-hand side, Harmer into the area, Neto's going to punch in, he's going to be in, is it? Jack Robinson, Anthony yes! Taylor waits for the watch, and it is! The keeper made a real mess of it, it came to Robinson, it hit the post, it's over the line, and it's the skipper for the day, <laughs> Jack Robinson, with his first goal of the season, who goes and slides in front of an absolutely rocking away end here at the Vitality. <laughs> They've had a horrible week of Sheffield United, what a response this is, we've got 25 minutes to go, it's Bournemouth nil, Sheffield United 2. As uh, Bournemouth looked to come forward here, a bit shell-shocked everyone around the vitality. Still plenty of time, it's going to be hit by Watara, it's bobbling around in the middle, and then Solanke will prod the ball home. It's a really soft goal for Sheffield United to concede. Well, Look, referee Anthony Taylor is waiting here. There's Vinny Souza was straight in, suggesting that there might have been a handball in there. And the goal's been overturned. Here's the... Uh, the sub in Sinistera oh. who takes a strike. Here comes the corner from the right hand side. That went Hodgicks in there. Our blaster away. And now Sheffield United will look to counter attack. And Brereton Diaz has done really well to get the ball under control. Goes away down the left hand side. Wants some options oh, in the middle. Going. He's going to continue it's his going. run now into the area. Ben Brereton Diaz puts it across the middle. Needed somebody running in and smashing him. Goes across for Cook, who's going to oh. drill it over the top of the bar from 25. Here comes Semenyo down the right, his trickery is good, but Robinson has done well there, McAtee was helping him. A little chorus, the greasy chip butty song, ringing around the vitality is the corner, into the near post, headed in! Really good leap as well by Dongo Watara. Rose Heist in the area, excellent delivery from the far side. We hope that they could get through a little bit more. They've got 17 minutes to hold on now at the Vitality Stadium. Watara pulls one back, Bournemouth one, Sheffield United two. Harmer on the right, Souza and Arblaster in the middle. Oh, as Osborne mistake. misses his kick, is uh, Semenyo. Comes off Robinson, it's behind for another corner. 12 minutes to go, Bournemouth one, Sheffield United two in the Premier League. In towards the near oh. post, here's Gerbic who will claim it. Out to the left-hand side now for Watara into the area. Go Header goes as well. far Run as well. Will oh. Asulu looks to get beyond his man, gets a little clip in there. Eight <laughs> additional minutes. Here comes Sinistera oh. off the left towards the byline. Nor will go sliding in Sinistera. Looked like he overran it to me, but referee Taylor says there was a touch on there and it's behind for a Bournemouth corner. Scott with the, the corner. Near side, plenty of bend on it towards the back post, headed in, Gerbic is there, Norwood off the line. Oh. Flick back into the middle, oh, knocked no. on towards the back post and then turned home. <laughs> the finish from Enes Unal, Sheffield United, early in additional time, just couldn't get the ball away. Semenyo had a little He's shout in the face of Baldock as well. And that is a, such a shame for the Blades who've led for the majority of this game in the first minute of added time. Bournemouth equalised. Bournemouth 2, Sheffield United 2. Here's Sinistera, though. The league's low to the edge of the area. George Baldock goes back with him. Sinistera across, goal and wide! Lewis Sinistera, Baldock still there with him. Sinistera looking to go once again at pace. Norwell's trying to get back there to help. To the edge of the area for Billing, can't keep it down. We've played the eight minutes of additional time. Now Sheffield United can break with Willis Euler. He's going to have to go on his own here, the young Dane. He powers away, away to the left-hand side. Nobody's coming yes. with him. He's got three with him. There's the whistle from Anthony Taylor.